Hello everyone. So I just finished my day four of my dry fast, and today it's keep deep digging deep into the acidosis process, and I feel really okay. I don't feel hungry. I still go to pee. That proves that my body is still、um, generating endogenic water、um, and helping my body to. Get rid of the toxins.、Um, I still haven't poop, but I think that tomorrow or day after I will have some poop.、Um, so yesterday we talk about、um, dry fasting turn off the protein kinase A (PKA) that、um, activate the stem cell production. And today I want to talk about <coughs> another function of dry fast, which.、Um, Uh, react on the DNA level. So methylation is a term that uh, um, when aging cells in the tip of the the DNA it starts methylate, so it stop producing protein and it cause aging. And however, in dry fasting or exercise or cold showers, this all Stress will、uh, make our body to produce a substance called NAD plus、uh, nicotine amine adenine dinucleotide. So this substance will activate ser serotonins, SIRT. So SIRT has seven of them: SIRT one to SIRT seven. So mainly SIRT six is will be activated、uh, to turn on the BER pathway, and that will remove the methylation process, methylation markers on the DNA、uh, on the tip of the DNA. So this process can actually de-aging our body and making all the DNA cells to reproduce protein again. So with that said, we really want NAD plus level to be maintained high, and prolonged dry fasting or taking cold shower can really do、uh, make this magic happen. So to conclude, dry fasting can、uh, increase cellular and autophagic repair, demethylate DNA. Activating stem cells, so it, in the end, can reduce can produce radical life extension. So we really we can live longer by、um, occasionally doing this dry fast. So that's what I want to share today, and I'll still keep posting.、Uh, The last few days of my dry fast, and let you know how I can exit the fast safely and not making my not harming my body. Thank you very much for staying tuned with me, and hope you have a very lovely day and night. Namaste.